We are also watching what is happening in Florida. Blue Origin's new flagship rocket, New Glenn, is sitting on the launch pad. We are 46 minutes away, sorry, 45 seconds away from a launch from the, uh, the Complex 36 in Florida. This is a huge moment for this company that has delayed and delayed and delayed. And watch what has happened over at SpaceX. Let's listen in to what is happening on the other side of the Atlantic in Florida, a huge moment as we watch the launch of this rocket. This water deluge. Here we go, New Glenn. It's time to do this. Let's light this candle. Autopilot enabled. T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 1. Lift off. Engines at full thrust. Chicken for pressures are good. Vehicle cleared the tower. Now passing 18 seconds into flight. Engine chamber pressures look good. 27 seconds in. Vehicles now begun the pitch roll maneuver to point down range. Body rate response are nominal. Chamber pressures continue to look good. Now 40 seconds into flight. <laughs> End of roll straight to now level. Chamber pressures continue to look good. 50 seconds in. Data quality looks good coming down from the vehicle. Chamber pressures continue to look nominal. One minute into flight. All seven engines. Continue to look good on the first stage. Data quality is good coming down from the vehicle. Body rate response are nominal. One minute, 15 seconds into flight. As we build a road to space for the benefit of Earth. Profile looks good. Seven BE4 engines. You're looking at live pictures of the event taking place somewhere now above Florida as the New Glenn rockets driven by Jeff Bezos, you could argue, in so many ways, as well as those rockets, finally launches. A huge moment. Um, Tom, the SpaceX have some serious competition. Well, this is the competition, as you say. About a decade in the making, their engineering approach has been very different. This is, has a bigger payload than the Falcon rocket of SpaceX, though the Starship, which they're building out right now at SpaceX, will have a heavier payload than even this. But for now, this is a catch-up play yep. from Jeff Bezos, and this is significant. What we're going to be watching for next is how this rocket detaches, and indeed, if the main part of the rocket is able to land successfully on this ocean drone yep. because the reusable component is so essential to Jeff Bezos as it is for Elon Musk at SpaceX as well. So that will be the next part of this journey that we will monitor and bring for you live. But this, of course, is a huge milestone for Bezos and Blue Origin. They have a test satellite as part of that payload and they'll be getting data back from that as well. Absolutely. Um, a lot has got into this a huge moment for this company as it makes a huge step forward in terms of its ability to launch into low Earth, medium, high Earth orbits.